Hey there, I'm Luke Barber with Strategy Email Marketing and I hope you're having a great day today. I'm about to make your day better because I'm gonna save you some money today. <laughs> and the way I'm gonna do that is by telling you not to buy this book. I have to tell you, I, I looked up uh, Adela pa Passos, I'm probably saying her name wrong, but I looked up the author of this book, bottom line. She seems very knowledgeable. Okay, so I'm not I'm not trying to uh, uh, talk crap about her or anything like that because I checked out some of her YouTube videos. I checked out her website. She's giving really good actionable advice on all of the content that she's putting out. So I have no doubt that she knows what she's doing. But I got to be honest, this book needed some more meat, in my opinion. So I hope uh, uh, it probably won't make a difference now unless she makes a big update to it and does a reprint. But the point is, this book, which is called The Email Marketing Playbook Game Plan, wasn't really much of a game plan. It was almost like it was her outline to write an actual book. It was, it was just a lot of bullet points and things of that nature. And it appeared to be like it was a, a it appeared to me anyway, like it was an ebook that she was going to, that she either gave away as a lead magnet or that she was selling for a low dollar offer. Case in point, what does that say to you right there? See that? Introduction about this ebook. Hmm, well, doesn't feel very electronic to me. Anyway, um, yeah, this this felt a lot like like just an outline. A lot of it is just bullet points. Look, I'll show you. So see, a lot of it is just kind of bullet points. It doesn't really go into very much depth. So for what I paid for this, I've paid less for other books and got more. So I was a little disappointed in this book. There were a couple of pages that did have bullet points that were for some templates for writing really good subject lines. So I liked those. That was definitely a pro. It was also a really quick read. I think I read this in maybe 40, 45 minutes. Again, not going to be that beneficial to you if you decide not to buy it based on this recommendation. Um, I always try and look for that one nugget that's gonna that's gonna make the book worth it. And I mean, there were a few points in there. I honestly can't tell you what they are right now. <laughs> um, but if you decide you want to get this uh, book, there there were some strategies in there as far as lists of ways to make money yeah she she gives she gives good lists of a few things right so like for this one she gives you a good example of a list of ideas uh, of types of emails campaigns to write you know that's good information like I said there were some subject lines in here that were good information that you could take and use to get better opens of course if you've seen my video about the book email persuasion that I also did a review on You'll know that Ian Brody talks about creating customer personas or customer profiles and having a good sender reputation and that by having a good sender reputation, you're going to get people to open your emails more often whether you have good subject lines or not. Anyway, that's that's for another video. I'll, I'll link to that video uh, in this video as well so you can check that one out. Uh, the cons to this book's... The cons to this book is, as I mentioned before, there's just not a lot of actionable content. It's just kind of a couple, it's just a bunch of lists of different bullet points of different things. Not really a whole bunch behind strategy, not really a whole bunch behind the psychology uh, of marketing, of sales, of, of getting people to engage, open, and interact with your emails. So my opinion, if you really are just trying to get you know, one nugget, you could probably get one or two out of this. But for the most part, I, I would I would spend your your research, your educational book dollars, whatever you call them for your your educational budget, I would I would spend them somewhere else. So no no knocking Adela or Adea, no knocking her. Uh, just she could have done a better job on the book. I hope that review helps you. If it does, please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel for more email marketing related content and leave me a comment below as to 
some of your favorite email marketing books or if you have a book that you'd like me to review or tell me how this review helped you. All right, we'll see you next time.